Hey everybody, it's Carl. Today I'm opening one pack of Topps 2008 Opening Day Baseball Cards. What is this? Uh, six cards plus one piece of gum. And we'll go into our fishbowl and give these cards to Robert from Florida. Robert, congratulations. I've drawn your name from the fishbowl, which is really easy to enter to win free cards. And along with this, I'll put something else in there too because it's a 99 cent pack and to ship it, it's going to cost about buck fifty or something. So we'll do that. So Robert, let's see what you get. Out of this pack, I love opening day as compared to other top stuff all the time, except 2004. It looked funny. Russell Martin and Casey Blake. Piece of gum, you get that. Doesn't look as pink as most of the gum is lately. Um, let's see what this is. Jake PV tops number 13 of 28. Um, don't know what this is. Oh, maybe one of those puzzles? I don't know. All right, Michael Young, Brian Roberts, Bobby Abreu, Abreu. and David Wright, students work hard, get cards. So, um, Robert, you get those cards. I'll send you something else, too. If you want to enter the fishbowl, very easy. I tell you in almost every single one of my videos, you send me your name, your email address, and your mailing address to carlscards at carlscards.com. Carl with K, cards with K, comma with a C. And I enter you into the fishbowl. It's all you have to do. And I've got thousands of names in there, so if I don't pull your name after a few weeks, don't email me and go, did you put me in there? I didn't hear back from you. It's like, man, yes, you were in there. Honest, trust me. Like Robert, he probably put his name in there a while ago and was like, yeah, I want something. So, good. Anyway. The Mitchell Report stuff was all in the news yesterday. They said, well, we're not going to do anything to these guys. Good job. That's what you should have done from the start. You shouldn't have made any news about it at all and said, nah, we can't do anything. So instead, you got what? The U.S. government now says, we wanted them to put the doping controls over to the U.S. Anti-Doping Agency, and then they can tell us what about sports and baseball. Okay, remember what I said about the Mitchell Report last time? When's the last time that Roger Clemens or Barry Bonds or Sammy Sosa made... A decision that had anything to do with national security or safety or tax money or anything. Never! So don't worry about what the heck they do. They're baseball players. Great ones at that. Very good ones. Barry Bonds, Sammy Sosa, Roger Clemens, Rafael Palmero, Jose Canseco. Good baseball players. That's all it is. Entertainment value. They're great at sports. Now what you need to do, whitey government it starts sending the U.S. Anti-Doping Agency to Congress and to legislators all over the country because you know what? We've got mayors that run this country on crack. We've got people in our Senate and in the House and in other areas of the government that smoke crack, snort coke, do all these crazy drugs, but you know what? We don't care, do we? Man, that should be taken care of right now because those people depend on everything that they do for their paycheck and for our national security and what our tax money is going to do. Do we want to pay for some cracked out legislator to go to a whorehouse? No. You don't want to do that, do you? Well, get these guys off crack. <laughs> our government, Whitey, uses drugs more than professional baseball ever could dream of. But they're just trying to pass the buck and say, oh, baseball's bad. Baseball's great. Those players are awesome. They deserve a lot more than you give them credit for. But you just want to drag them in front of Congress. You can say, hey, Roger Clemens is going to be here. I'm going to have him testify in front of us and say, you know what? Maybe he can sign my baseball cards. Bravo, government. <laughs> Bad news. So, just like I said earlier, you want to change the government? Not much you can do about it because you have no say. Whitey's in control. Kind of sucks. We're going to give more stuff away later, so all you got to do is watch my videos every day or every couple days if I'm out of town, and woo, give away free stuff. <laughs> Clap the pots and pans together. <laughs> all right, everybody, it's Carl. I'll talk to you later. Boo-boo!